Hello friends, this is Sandra here from woolifier.com and wimsydreamsclipart.com. In this tutorial, we are going to make a beautiful birthday card that is suitable for moms or, you know, friends or anyone who loves florals. For creating this card, we are going to use Canva Pro. And you find a link down below in the description if you don't have Canva yet. Uh, I'm an affiliate of Canva because I love Can Canva and endorse Canva from the bottom of my heart. All the graphics used in this tutorial you can find in the whimsydreamsclipart.com shop as well. But of course you can change and use any graphics you like. If you like this tutorial please give me a thumbs up and subscribe, it really helps the channel to grow. Let's start creating your beautiful card. First of all, you go to canva.com, then you go to create a design up in the right corner. Search for birthday card. And then you click it. Let's collapse this menu. First of all, we are going to apply the text. So. Click on the text here in the left sidebar and drag your text into the card design. Now we go to the font tool, click it. For this design, we are going to use the Sensa Wild Fill and Montserrat font. So let's click Sensa Wild Fill. You find it by searching Sensa wild fill. Activate the text by triple clicking on it. Like this. Make sure it is centered. Now we're going to find a divider. Go to Elements, search for Divider. You have lots of options here. I will go with this uh, organic looking whimsical divider. I think it's so cute. This, make sure it is centered. Now we go back to text and we drag or click the text like this, change it to Montserrat and write and now you write your uh, little greeting here, personal greeting. I wish you a fantastic day. Now let's apply the beautiful floral graphic to this card. You find a link down below in the description as well. And of course you can use whichever floral graphic you like. There are lots of them in Canva as well. Then you go to upload media, click on device and you find your downloaded graphics from the shop here. And then we go to graphic number three and it's uploading like this. Now you click and drag. Activate the floral frame and enlarge it, maybe like this. We notch it a little bit, like this. Perfect. Now we're ready to print this beautiful card. You go to download, make sure PDF print is activated here. This ensures crisp and clear prints. If you want crop marks, this is very helpful when you're cropping your card. Activate crop marks and bleed as well. And download. This is how your final card looks like. And now you go print this in your printer at home. Make sure you have a high quality paper, as sturdy and thick as you possible can get at home. This ensures the best results. If you love this tutorial, please consider subscribing. And if you like the graphics, you find a link to my newsletter in the description as well. With this link, you get a 20% coupon code on your purchases from the shop. Happy creating, friends, and see you in the next video.